Movies have some of the most breathtaking scenery you'd ever see, especially those about interplanetary travel. Still, you don't have to visit some imaginary planet when we've got some places here on Earth that will leave you breathless. Is it the world's highest sky corridor door waterfall walkway in China with impressive night lighting, or the mesmerizing Ruyi Bridge? Maybe it'll be the Crater of Fire, dubbed the Door to Hell, that leaves your mouth ajar in disbelief. In this video, we'll bring you 20 unbelievably fascinating places that, if they weren't recorded, you wouldn't believe existed. So why don't you get your astonishing meters ready for these unique places and let's dive into them. Number 20. Guangdong's Highest Sky Corridor Waterfall. When it comes to larger-than-life sightseeing spots on the planet, you gotta visit Guangdong's Highest Sky Corridor Waterfall Walkway in China. This giant racket-like sky corridor, located at the Wangtung Gorge in Punyang, is known as the oversized racket by tourists for obvious reasons. The majestic sky corridor is built in such a way that it looks like two tennis rackets positioned across a mountain. Want to know how tall the structure is? It's as tall as a 166-story building. It's a project that cost around 268 million won, equivalent to about 40 million US dollars. For sure, all that money means the walkway would have state-of-the-art features, and boy, does it have them. It was designed in a manner installed with 450 water nozzles and over 2,000 electric lights on the outermost circular bridge that reacts to the music played. When you walk along the see-through platform of the sky corridor, you can hear the sound of glass cracking. Even worse, you could look down to see cracks under your feet, but not to worry, it's just one of those special effects of the bridge that sends chills down the visitor's spines. Number 19. Underwater Waterfall. Who wouldn't want to be like this guy, sitting on a plane, as you watch how beautifully an island gets sucked into an abyss? First, this is the underwater waterfall off the coast of Lamorne in Mauritius, and secondly, it's just one of the world's most spectacular illusions. No island is getting sucked into a drain. This dramatic scene you see is just the flow of underwater currents. Once on the shore, you can also see the sand and silt illusion, but for the best views, you'll have to hop onto a seaplane to explore the idea from above. Number 18. Niagara Falls. Those who know about Niagara Falls would agree there's more to the waterfall than just being the world's second tallest waterfall. It's a breathtaking and romantic wonder that gushes over 3,160 tons of water per second, amounting to about 700,000 gallons of water flowing down at around 100 miles per hour. Although the story behind its formation is a bit foggy, many agree that the Ice Age shaped these falls more than 12,000 years ago when vast chunks broke off North America into Lake Erie, leaving large cracks that started to fill up, creating what we see in a door today. But when you get there, you'll realize that Niagara Falls comprises three waterfalls, the Bridal Veil Falls, the American Falls, and the Majestic Horseshoe Falls. All located on the border of Ontario Province, Canada. Of course, such a beautiful mystery would attract daredevils who would like to perform extreme stunts to marvel onlookers. Niagara Falls has had some such people. For example, in 1859, Charles Blondin did one of the most daring tightrope walks across it, wearing nothing but some pink tights. More recently, in 2012, Nick Walenda became the first person to repeat the feat in front of a live audience and millions who watched worldwide. Whether you're out looking for some extreme adventure or just want a sweet romantic getaway for you and your loved ones, Niagara Falls has got you covered. Number 17. Ruyi Bridge At first glance, the Ruyi Bridge may come off as a simulated location which can only exist behind screens. But take a trip to Shinju Valley in China's Zhang province and you'll marvel at this brilliant architectural design. As if having a weird-looking structure isn't enough, the bridge is made of glass. All the materials you could build a bridge with, and they opted for glass. Why create a bridge people would be scared of? Maybe if you weren't such a big baby like me, you'd be able to walk over the bridge. I bet they have adult diaper changing rooms at either end. Once on the mind-boggling bridge, which is 140 meters above a ravine, you'll enjoy the best view of the surrounding colorful hills and valleys. Number 16. Jewel Chani Airport. Singapore getting stuck in an airport for hours can be a bit of a bummer, 
but sometimes it can be a blessing in disguise. Especially when you happen to get stuck in an airport such as this. Check out the scenes at this place, it's extraordinary. No wonder the airport has won the world's best airport award more than seven times. The airport's lifestyle hub is second to none. The Jewel Hub was opened to the general public in April 2019. A massive donut-shaped building which cost over $1.25 billion to construct. It's located between the control tower and Terminal 1. The glass part steel structure has loads of amenities, but most notably, it has a rainforest and the tallest indoor waterfall you can top. That it also has and five above the ground. The waterfall is a rain vortex, a cascading funnel of water that drops seven stories through the core of the building. The 130 feet tall waterfall is sourced with rainwater recirculated throughout the waterfall and serves as a 3D canvas at night. I wonder if they allow family vacations to the airport. Seriously, you could come to this airport, set up camp, and never leave, only that the authorities wouldn't allow it. Number 15. Reynas Fiara Beach, Iceland's water is wet, roses are red, and beaches usually have grey sand. Right. Well, the Reynas Fiara Beach is unlike any other beach in terms of its ratio. While other beaches agreed on having grey sand, this beach chose to give Mother Nature the middle finger and became a unique black beach. The picture-perfect and astonishing beach is situated on the southern coast of Iceland, close to the country's capital Reykjavik. Reynas Fjara Beach is an unusual beach famed for its black-colored sand. It's undoubtedly one of the world's most unique and gorgeous beaches. Its black sand comes from lava flowing across the ocean, which then turns black as it cools and hardens before suddenly breaking apart. Did I mention that the beach is near a large sleeping volcano? Yeah, it is, but not to worry, the volcano remains refrigerated under the ice as with soil surrounding volcanic places. The black sand is rich in volcanic materials, pebbles, and stone. There's more than meets the eye to this unique beach. Reynas Fiara Beach has some awe-inspiring calmer ball saw formations that you should check out. Number 14. Munner. Kerala's beautiful scenery doesn't have to be an exotic beach, a dazzling waterfall, or a stunning bridge. It can also be an entire town. Say hello to Munner a picturesque landscape that is a refreshing lush green tea plantation with an excellent climate and a whiff of calm breeze, rich in abundant fauna and flora. It's like a town that didn't age since its time on Middle Earth. Munnar is a small town in the Iduki district located in the Western Ghats mountain range of southern India. Its name, Munnar, means three rivers, and this is because of the three rivers that meet there. The town is the most extensive tea-growing area in South India. Aside from growing tea, they have some beautiful flowers, with the wild Neela famous of the lot, a flower that only blossoms once in 12 years. Munnar is a perfect tourist spot for lovers of nature and food. Number 13. Salar de Uyuni, Bolivia. From one otherworldly landscape to another, the Salar de Uyuni is so out of this world that it was used as one of the filming locations for Star Wars, The Last Jedi. But that's not all. It has also appeared in movies like The Fall and Salt and Fire. The Salt Flat is the largest in the world, spanning an incredible 10,000 square kilometers and sitting at about 3,656 meters above sea level. Its incredibly flat, salty surface creates fantastic mirages that turn the entire area into a mirror, making it the most enormous mirror on the planet. The reflections are so picture perfect that it's hard to discern the horizon. This is one strange yet excellent place to visit, and the best part is you don't need to pack a mirror. Number 12. Antelope Canyon. Before we go any further, I'd like to point out that there are no antelopes in this canyon, at least not that I know of, so who named it? Never mind, let's just talk about the place. Off the east of the page on Navajo land in Arizona lies Antelope Canyon. The canyon has a wavy structure that gives it a unique look and beautiful light beams, making it any photographer's dream. The canyons were formed by floods and wind that eroded curved passages in the Navajo sandstone. It has two separate canyons, with the upper one being the easiest to access. You can also take beautiful pictures in the canyon, but you can only visit as part of a guided tour as the canyons still flood from time to time. 
You can see this canyon in movies like Broken Arrow and Samsara, but nothing beats seeing it in real life. Number 11. Cano Cristales River, located in the remote area of Meta in Colombia, is one of those unique places that require a plane, a boat, a car, and some hiking to reach. This fast-flowing river has abnormally bright and colorful water, which includes waterfalls, rapids, the river itself, and a couple of pools during peak season. Donning vivid colors such as red, blue-black, green, and yellow, the red color is a result of the river weed clover, which changes from green to red when water and sun conditions reach a certain level. The other colors are just a combination of water, rocks, and sand. If you've ever dreamt of fishing in a rainbow pool, keep dreaming because Cano Cristales doesn't have any fish. Rainbows would be jealous of this river. Number 10. Patient Lake, located amidst exquisite red hills and lush green pastures, is such a beauty to behold with fresh air and tranquility. It offers an experience like no other for those looking to hike, explore nature, and have an all-around outdoor adventure. The relatively new lake guarantees a lifetime of adventure and is a must-visit place. One fantastic fact about Patian Lake is that it's only accessible in summer due to heavy snowfalls in winter. It is one of the most beautiful lakes in the Radcliffe National Park of Pakistan, wonderfully covered with red and blue flowerbeds on the lush green mountains. Along with its blue watercolor, it presents a scenery to behold. It is also one of the longest lakes in the Neelam Valley. When you visit the lake in June, you'll see the glaciers at a temperature of about 10 degrees Celsius, accompanied by new spring breezes that precede summer, all within hills covered with snow most parts of the year. It is definitely a place for every outdoor person. Number 9. Believe it or not, the eruption of the Calbuco volcano in Chile was a beautiful yet destructive scene. How can something so devastating look so heavenly? It beats me. Although this isn't a tourist spot, not that you'd want to visit anyway. The Calbuco erupted for the first time since 1972 in 2015, vigorously spewing ash and pumice for at least 90 minutes before the lava flow was observed from the central vent. Luckily, the surrounding villages were evacuated in time, and nearly 2,000 people were reported to be unharmed. However, the ash rose at least 15 kilometers above the volcano, which was simply amazing. Number 8. OIA Greece, arguably one of the most photographed towns in Greece, is a beautiful town located on the northeastern tip of the island of Santorini. The small town has beautiful white houses perched on a cliff. Nothing beats the sunset views of this town. The sunset view is one thing, but OIA also offers fascinating views of the terraced island, the Pelea volcano, and the Neo Camini. The town is famed for its white-walled stone houses. You better watch where you put your hands. Then there's the blue-domed monastery which has become a symbol of small-town Greece. The town may be small, but be sure to take your walking shoes if you visit. You'd have to tackle a flight of 300 stairs before reaching it from the harbor. With such beautiful scenery, I wouldn't mind taking 500 more steps. Easier said than done, I know. Number 7. Door to hell having a fire burning non-stop for 44 years is a sight to behold, and if that fire is burning inside a crater that's 20 meters deep and the size of an American football field, it is one of the places you've got to see on Earth. The Door to Hell is the name given to a massive natural gas-filled crater with a continuously burning fire, but its real name is the Derwiz Cavity because it's located in Derwiz Ahal province in Turkmenistan. How did a hole manage to sustain fire for over 40 years, and how come no one has tried putting out the fire? The crater was said to have been formed incidentally by some Soviet engineers when they thought it would be a source of oil for the world. Oh, how wrong they were! Unfortunately, after digging the place, they only found a poisonous gas instead of oil. So, rather than allowing the gas to travel to nearby villages, they decided to light it up, and it's been ablaze ever since. However, they only estimated it would burn for two weeks. Being a fiery hole and all, Canadian explorer George Corinnes took it upon himself to be the first person to set foot at the bottom of the crater. Who does he think he is, a firebender? Still, now the president has ordered for the fire to be quelled and the hole to be sealed to make room for more drilling sites. 
This is one place to give a glimpse of what the hell would look like, but on the bright side, it makes for an excellent campsite, especially for the crater's stunning effect at night. Number 6. Victoria Falls also known as the Devil's Pool or the Smoke That Thunders by Locals. Victoria Falls is Africa's version of Niagara Falls. It's located on the Zambezi River, which forms a part of the border between Zimbabwe and Zambia. The waterfall is over 1,708 meters wide and 108 meters high. It's one of the biggest waterfalls in the world and one of the most beautiful places you can visit. At its peak, an incredible 500 million liters of water crashes down the falls every minute, creating a thunderous roar that can be heard 40 kilometers away. The resulting spray usually rises 400 meters above the falls and causes a permanent cloud of smoke, so you get where all the smoke that thunders is coming from. Number 5. Canola Flower Fields Looping China Yellow is a bright, alluring color that breathes life into all it comes across. If you're a big fan of yellow, this is one spot you'll have to visit, the Lupine County in the area of Yunnan. China is usually quiet for most of the year until the canola blooms. The fields are grown to produce cooking oil from the canola seeds, also known as rapeseed. These fields are the favorite spot of bee tourists and photographers. Hence, the best time to visit is between February and March when the flowers bloom. Also, at the beginning of the canola season, an annual festival is held to celebrate the flowers, so you could also attend that. Number 4. Machu Picchu, Peru When a place rhymes with a picture, you can almost bet it will always give breathtaking images every time. Not just that, it also plays a vital role in human history by being one of the historic sites. The citadel was built sometime around the 1480s and was abandoned during the Spanish conquest of Peru. It is located northeast of Cusco, Peru, and offers insight into the Inca people's heritage. You'll need to climb a 2,430-meter-high mountain to get to Machu Picchu. Reaching the site's summit is on the bucket list of several people for a good reason. It gives you the feeling of finding a lost city, bringing out Indiana Jones in you. Number 3. Mount Fuji is Japan's most visited tourist attraction, with over 300,000 visitors yearly. Mount Fuji is truly one of the hearts of many outdoor explorers. To think that the mountain can only be accessed for two months in a year shows how sought after this mountain is. Who wouldn't want to visit a peak of three separate volcanoes? There's Komataki at the bottom, Kochin in the middle, and Fuji on top. Did I also mention that the mountain is an active volcano? Oops, but don't worry about that. The volcano hasn't erupted since 1707 when it erupted for two weeks. That aside, the mountain trails offer an unrivaled view of the surrounding five lakes, which play a significant role in Japan's cultural and spiritual geography. It also provides some hot springs ideal for easing the aches and pains you might have after a long day's climbing. Number 2. Old Bagan Myanmar. Here's another place you have to see to believe. Located in Myanmar's Mandalay region, Old Bagan was the capital during its time and the peak of the city's dominance. More than 4,400 Buddhist temples, pagodas, and monasteries were built on these plains. Today, the ruins of over 3,800 of those structures populate the area, and you can explore many of them on foot, or you can opt for a hot balloon ride to get an aerial view of the magnificence of this place. It's one of those genuinely fantastic places that will leave you breathless. The world is filled with so many waterfalls. Check out the one sent to us by a subscriber. This is undoubtedly one of nature's wonders, just like these other waterfalls. But as you can see, it's a compilation of waterfalls. We couldn't determine if it was real or fake after we did some digging. Let's have a look. Although it looks very dreamy, our number one is 100% real. Number 1. Panchin Red Beach, China. We've explored some of the most jaw-dropping spots, from black beaches to technologically advanced structures. I hope you have some all left for just one more. We found a beach that isn't covered with sand. Strange, right? Let me explain. Panchin Red Beach is not like other beaches. Instead of being covered with sand, the beach is red thanks to a plant called Suida salsa or seepweed. The beach is located within the most extensive wetland and reed marsh in the world, 
in Liaoning Province. Although the beach is closed to the public to preserve it, a small portion is used as a tourist attraction center. Alright, please comment below which of these beautiful places is your favorite and which one you'd love to visit if you haven't already. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to Amazing World, and hit the bell icon for more exciting content.